We are back at Omar's. Continuing where we left off with Logan's SR swap. What's left now? I see coolant going in. That's a good sign, Travis. There's a Math. lot going on. Well, I it's green corn. I've never seen it in my life. Really? I see green a lot. Oh, dude, we got our hole perfectly centered just for eyeballing it. <laughs> I'm hyped on that. Perfect. Unfortunately, we were not able to fully drill the hole out last night, so Logan picked up another hole dozer. Hole dozer. <laughs> That's actually a really funny name. They knew what they were doing when they were naming this product, that's for sure. But that definitely got the job done. Our other two bits did not do the job at all. They don't call me Pizza Mike for no reason. Thought it was Junkyard Mike. Junkyard Mike, honestly. Maybe I should go to the junkyard tomorrow. You know what, I will. You hungry? Want yeah. some pizza? I got green pepper and pineapple. Oh, oh, he wants to eat too. He does. <laughs> <laughs> Get away from the pizza. All right, while Logan's finishing up on his SR swap here, Omar needs some help gardening here. And if you guys remember in the last video, we used the 300ZX to haul dirt, and this thing was squatting in the back. Now he wants me to move rocks from one side of his yard to the other. I think instead of damaging my trunk, maybe we'll use the Gloria. I only suggest this car because the trunk is already a little bit dented. Not too bad. You know, this is, this is still nice, right? But I'm not gonna care if it gets scratched. Oh my gosh, this thing needs a wash. Oh, there we go. Oh, forgot this is right-hand drive. Oops. So this thing is so clean. I always forget how nice this car actually is. And look at that, my jump pack is still in here. Hopefully it's still charged. Oh, this hood is so heavy. Okay. All right, well, let's see if that even works. <laughs> Probably needs to charge up a little bit more, but I'm impatient. <laughs> ah, second time's a charm. Good to be back in this thing. Oh, it's so weird finding the clutch pedal. There is a third pedal over here, but it's actually the e-brake, surprisingly. Yeah, it's, it's running, can you I hear it? I didn't even hear it when I was right there. Really? Yeah. Oh my God, look at the wheels. Yeah, it's covered in grass. Oh, our mirrors are in. Hold up, hold up. I think there's a button for that. Yeah, extendo? Yo! <laughs> That's awesome. I'll put my buttons away. Ah, VIP. Gotta turn this radio off. Uh, power? There we go. Even in the grass, this thing drives really nice. Yeah, we need to move these bricks here. This is such a good looking car. Minus that part. <laughs> All right, guess we got a Pop the trunk, put the key in. Nah, I wish. Still on junkyard mode at this car. Okay. Make sure this isn't gonna bust this windshield or back glass. It's on the glass in that corner. Yeah, just be cautious with it, I guess. Um, That's a gas thing. Yeah, the fuel tank. That is wild. Right? That's wild. In the cabin, I've never seen... Actually, I think the SCs are like that. The Lexus really? SC. Yeah. That's wild. Look at all the EVAP stuff on it. Where's oh, this? Line? Yeah, this is fuel lines. Oh my gosh. Feed, return. I guess this one's EVAP then. That's wild. This is the harness for it. That's wild. <laughs> this is really strange here. It's like an open tube of some sort. Oh, look at this. Japanese water. Japanese water, baby. Drink it. Yeah, there's no goodies in the back of this thing. Just bent metal. Oh, not those. Not these ones? No, oh, the other ones. Not these? We're halfway done. Omar. <laughs> oh my we don't have God. enough of those to make a pit. Be scraping. Oh, yeah. We got room for more. 
I'm wondering if it's tucking too much now. Well, look at the other side. It's gonna have to make it. It's got front rake like my Z now. I think you're gonna rub. <laughs> I think we're gonna rub? Yeah. I don't know, man. Don't mess up my grass. Burn out? <laughs> oh, you're golden. You oh, it's, rub it's rubbing. It sounds wild back there. The tow hook is scraping. The tow hook is scraping? <laughs> the whole exhaust is scraping. Oh, whatever's on the left side with the exhaust. Is that the muffler? I don't know. These wheels are still for sale. Tires are still good if anyone's interested. Here, let me, let me try to pick it up. Oh, it's kind of hot. Oh, I can't lift it. Right, try it, see direction. what happens a little bit. There you go. You're mowing my lawn. <laughs> you see the grass? <laughs> That's good. Stop, stop, stop. Oh. Thanks, Mike. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> She's low. Hey, it works. Oh, what? Yeah. We got an antenna. This wasn't up last time. Yeah, I, it wasn't. I didn't realize. I don't know. Wasn't paying attention. <laughs> All right. Let's count how many were in here. One. <laughs> we'll get. We'll get back to you guys. <laughs> Scale only goes up to 25 pounds. No way. Yeah. More, so it's over more. 25 pounds yeah, each. Read it. I thought it was a lot lighter, honestly. This looks pretty nice already. Yeah, no, it looks really good. 49 right there? 49. How many? You I got? had 27 right here. 49. That's a lot of weight. Right? That's a lot of weight. That's about a thousand plus pounds. 27. How much was one brick? Let's, let's say 24 pounds. How much each. was one brick? Pounds? Each Eight, brick is 24 pounds. 1800 pounds. No way. <laughs> Almost a ton? Almost a ton. Almost. Can this thing just hold it? <laughs> Dude, hardly rubbed. Hardly rubbed, and it did not struggle whatsoever. Is that on coilovers too? Yeah, it is. Damn, what kind of what kind Fortunato. Of, Fortunato. Fortunato. Shout out, shout out, Fortunato. Right. <laughs> right. Who's got a PBM car? PBM we can try press. this on. Travis, where's your S14? Yeah. PBM. I got. Ain't getting dirty in my car. All right, parts run. Ah. <sighs> This thing drives so good, man. We have arrived. He only needs like battler control valve hose and I don't even know what else he needs. Let's find out. We got your battery. Oh. It's gotta be like the slim one, right? It's gotta be slim and tiny. Dude, we should have tried to see if the uh, Honda battery I have fits. Where is it? It's in my Z. Like my new necklace? Dude, that battery is so small. Two hundred dollars for this. <laughs> for this. You'd think it'd be cheaper since it's half the size. Yeah, right. Probably special. Anything good? Got the static radio going. I have no idea what he's saying. No. Jesus. Jesus. I heard Jesus. Jesus. So close. Yeah, it's so far away. Battery fitment test. Oh, well, that is perfect. Perfect. Hopefully the terminal's clear. Better be straight cut, Logan. Straight straight, buddy. I didn't do that. That's great. That's pretty oh, straight. Oh, that's pretty good enough. Never thought I'd see intercooler pipes being cut with a handsaw. You gotta do what you gotta do around here. <laughs> I 
Nice. That was pretty straight. It was a little yeah. crooked. A little bit, but that's good, good enough. enough. It'll good work. Enough. Good enough. This shit done. Throttle, ghetto throttle cable done. Intake tube, and then that's really it, right? Intake and math. Think anything's left. Oh, the math. Well, that's part of the intake. Let her rip. Let her rip. Tater chip. One last final look over before first start. The nerves, bro. The nerves. I know okay. the engine runs. It's just Couple did we do everything it? right? Yeah. Yeah. You more nervous or excited? Nervous. Nervous? What? Money, dude. Yeah, yeah. And then we gotta tape this before we take it for a drive. Yeah, the clip's busted on this plug. Can't start the car without turn signals. Oh yeah, they're just parking lights, right? Well, they, I think they... All right, you ready? Side markers, dude. All right, all right. All right, yeah, start it up, come on. Got no power. <laughs> oh, let's start with that. Oh. Okay, round two. No prime, nothing. No prime. <laughs> he went straight for it. Let the fuel filter fill up. It's brand new. Are they All right. <laughs> hey. Oh. Yeah. Pretty healthy. So the coolant gauge was working? Yeah, it was working. V1 problem. Junk. So unfortunately, it looks like the coolant line that goes from the water inlet to, actually this is the water outlet, to the turbo was cross-threaded. So it actually oh, stripped. Oh, I didn't get it from the bottom. And he's trying to take off the line right now because we have to replace the line and the fitting. It was just dripping out no matter what. I mean, that's just gonna happen with aluminum connections like that. So hopefully we can find some at a local store. That looks really fun to get to. Can you even get to it from there? I got it like, I got it loosened. Oh, you did turn it? It turned. Nice little fitting. The culprit. Now, I'm sure a lot of you guys are wondering what's going on with the Gloria and what's next when am i starting it and currently i have someone out in japan looking for a quarter panel because i'm gonna need a quarter panel for this side i don't know if you can really tell in the video but it is buckled here and folded down here now i did have the rear clip that came with this car when i bought it but unfortunately that car that was cut up was totaled because it was t-boned right here so the quarter panel on the half cut is actually folded in worse than this one and also the trunk is busted on that one. It's not straight, there's no trunk latch. So I'm still looking for parts. I'm not gonna be able to line up everything as accurately as I'd like to. So I'm not gonna start the project until I have all of the parts. That way I can just go straight into it and then give it my full commitment. Cause I would hate to start this project and then wait for parts because finding parts for this car is not easy as I'm learning very quickly. Need to find a fog light cover as well. Yeah. And it looks like there may be some type of trim that goes here. I'm not really sure. Yeah, the door light's still on. 
Ooh. But I do love this car and I can't wait to be driving it around, that's for sure. Omar asked if I can pick up one of his body kits he just bought. Well, actually, he didn't even buy it. I had to pay for it. He's gonna pay me back, hopefully. But we're gonna see if we can even fit that in the Z. I said, we'll try, but no promises. Well, we did it. We fit the entire kit. Actually, this is an entire kit plus a front bumper and a front lip. Check it out. Nuts. Covered up the corners here just so they don't get damaged in transport, but it does fit. <laughs> Work truck. Now we drive an hour and a half through traffic on the tollway, all the way back to Omar's. I can't even sit straight up and down because the kit's in the way. Special delivery. Yeah. Skirt. Next skirt. Tybex front lip. Really? Yeah. Kooky front fiberglass. These were real fun to put in. Tybex famous? Yeah, those are the extensions. Extensions for the bump. There we go. All of that somehow fit almost done putting on the new stuff here one more to go and we can bleed this thing start it again we got to do the bottom one now yeah well that'll be fun yeah so this will take me a moment moment of truth with the coolant we're we gonna hold coolant this time dude uh, is it gonna stay in the engine we'll, we'll find out dude. dude the clearance is insane right here it's been, literally perfect it is actually perfect enough to let this spin so far so good so far, so good. Dude, this thing was thirsty. I hear something though. What is oh, that? Oh, it's coming from right here. That little sound. I see it bubbling right there. It's just this thing. Hey, uh, good news. Zolligan. It's dry. Origin aggressive. Aggressive. It is quite aggressive. Driftline. Origin driftline. Dude, that is fat. That is fatty. First start. Wait, second start. Second start. <laughs> <laughs> ah. All right, all right. Just watch it cool. Fired right up that time. All right, round two of inspections. Yeah, I don't see really anything. Looks dry so far. We saw some not so good smoke signs. We're gonna do a quick compression test here. You nervous, Logan? Always, always nervous, dude. When it comes to cars and engines, he's always nervous. So there's not something about engines that calms you down? Your name is not Jesse, okay? No, my name is not Jesse. My, my name, name is Logan, all right? <laughs> Spark plug testing goodies. There you go, okay. Logan. Crack the first one free. <laughs> Pray to the car gods. That's one of those fancy shrimpy boys. It's got a magnet on it. Yeah, great. Cheer it's, it's black. Bro, that is black. That is black. So those are fouled out to start off. <laughs> Done this once in my entire life, and then I hate that I have to do it again. What what engine did you do last? Uh, my single cam. Single cam? <laughs> did it turn out good? Oh, it was perfect. One that I sold Ben? Yeah. Perfect. Well, that's ours. What? Oh, 140. Keep the throttle body open. Ready? Hold on, hold on. Throttle body open. All right, go. All right, cranker. 150. 150. I sold throttle 150. Black. Number two is dark. 149. Logan's a little broke right now, so he can't afford spark plugs. It's better than the rubber. So we're going to brake clean them. No, this is the second one. Oh, he cleaned off instantly. A little something special. I approve of this message. 
Black. Black. Number three is dark. Another 150. Three out of four. So far, so good. Four, rich. Rich, rich, rich. Craigslist rebuild. Motor has been refreshed and rebuilt. Brand new. <laughs> We're good. All right, compression's good, dude. Compression is good. 150 across the board. This forbidden kit will be put away. Put, put it away. <laughs> I don't want to see that ever again. Right? It's always a bad time when this kit comes out. It's like, ah, is it actually blown? Oh, I feel so much better now. Dang. Freshened up with a wire brush. Went to school for uh, spark plug cleaning. <laughs> <laughs> My boy, did you even gap that? No, where's the gapper? <laughs> spark plug gap. 0.36. Okay, 0 .36. my biggest feeler gauge is 0.032. Here, 032. Let's try that. Too close? Too tight. Oh, there you go. Yeah, it's way too tight. A little big. I'm right, giving her a smack. There's two. There's three. And there's four. So apparently, the oil drain bolt is actually just an Allen. Allen bolt? Here, see if one of these work. Oh, first try, dude. Yeah? First try. Hey, don't strip it. <laughs> Nervous. Look, it's been scraped. Yeah, right? Ooh. It's dark. It's not even magnetic. Nice. What's you doing there? <laughs> Practicing. <laughs> Damn, there's a lot of oil in this thing, dude. For real. More than I thought. She looks clean, though. Yeah, no shiners. It's clean. Clean. Another, I mean, another. Clean of metal. Heart. <laughs> yeah, Bring metal. the garbage can over here. What do you call it? Release of the heart. Oh, oh, we'll push the pan forward. I tightened it back up. Hold on. <laughs> the rubber's well, off it. So it's a Wix? Oh my god. Bro. Red, Red, flag. Red flag. Hey, ladies. Oh my god. <laughs> what are you doing? You're going in dry? I already lubed it. Oh. Put some oil in the pressure, dog. Yeah, what are you doing? You're going in dry. No, don't fill it up. Know, just a little, little squirty, squirty. one third of the way. Just make her happy. It's green. It's yeah, green? It's, it's called green, dude. It's, got, it's an original green oil right there. Whoa, that's the weird. That's cool. That All those additives. It smells good. It's literally the best oil you can put in your that car. That smells good for oil. I'm, I'm telling you, for oil, it smells pretty good. The best oil you can put in your car? Let's see it. What we got? Pen grade. Partial synthetic. Oh, it's not full. No, all the part. <laughs> With your pouring skills. Pouring test. Oh my gosh! Oh, don't man. don't mess up. Don't. Uh. Okay. Oh! <laughs> that is green, dude. You got green coolant and green oil. Shoot. You're gonna know what's leaking. Mm, you ain't even gonna know. You're gonna have to test it. We you gotta, gotta taste your it. Car green now. <laughs> Hell no. Big green guy. H Drift HQ green. <laughs> <laughs> I think we should fire it up now. No. One quart. We're good. One quart. Pass around. Dude, don't even nudge this pan. <laughs> it's, it's to the brim. Is this oil or coolant? Ooh. Oh, it, oh, is, it darker. is darker. Miles don't, don't lie, boy. All right, remember your shades of green I here. Don't, I don't know, dude. It's starting to like flatten out and uh, oh, yeah. kind of get close. Upgrades? Damn, I'm even cooler now. My street crab went up plus one. That's like plus five. That's Insert the GTA San Andreas. a thousand dollars more. <laughs> now you can sell it for sixteen. Oh, that's what I found. Wow. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Let me see Fine. that. This whole time. That's right. We used the feeler gauge. Got the job done. Where do you want this thing so we know where it is? Uh, Top right. No little drawer. In the food box. Hell yeah, JDM boy. <laughs> yep. Dude, it's not misfired. Yeah. yeah. It actually sounds a lot better. Sounds like oh, right. Omar doesn't have an OG sound. While Logan's wrapping up his SR swap, we are going to be starting, hopefully, dropping an SR into this two tone coupe. What are we stuck in? <laughs> Nothing. Woo. There she goes. 
We are off. How are we looking? What's left? Where's the plug? For it's all the way over there. I guess the last thing we needed to do before a test drive is plug in the, plug in the O2 sensor because it was running a little bit rich. Is it reach? Or is it? Here's the plug. Is that as far as it's going? Maybe. <laughs> Look. No way. <laughs> Dude. Sounds good though. I think it's ready for a test drive regardless. I I'm bringing it home regardless. No, no, no. You're dude, follow I'm me? telling you. No, if you don't think me. that's fine, it's way I'll better to run rich than lean. Hey, maybe it just needs to run for a while. Yeah. What's the spark plug look like? <laughs> hey, question, question real quick. What? What's the spark plug look like when it's running lean? Gold. White. No, the White. gold is perfect. Wrong, fail. Gold is <laughs> what is going on in here? Dude, your injectors are still firing. Really? Yeah. What? What? No wonder why it's running rich. Yo, what the fuck? Did you hear that? Yeah, I heard it from all the way inside the garage. All right, maybe I'm not driving it home today. <laughs> <laughs> Igniter swap. Which one was I the one you took off? Oh no. <laughs> Did you actually remember? Because <laughs> yeah. I forgot. Nothing. No more clicks? Hey, yeah, now stick that wrench to both terminals. See if you're getting power to... <laughs> <laughs> what the, 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 the. Hair stands up. All right. Anything weird happening? Yeah, it's burning all the fuel out of there. No. Really? I don't know. Let's try. Try it again. Fire? Ready? Go ahead, go ahead. Nope, it's not firing anymore. That was wild. So I You're ready. I'm ready, dude. <laughs> Alright, I said we oh, put it on were, the ground, we second. drive it straight to my house. You were, you were locked and loaded on I was I was like this ready to go. He was ready. He was he was armed up. Alright, put it on the ground. Let's go. Put it on the ground. You wanna follow me home? Yeah, let's do it. Dude, that I'll probably do it like early morning. Omar gave me this nice new shifter. Finally got a gritty in here. I think it's a little step up from the still hood with the fifth gear. <laughs> Your first inches driving an SR. <laughs> oh, your hood's not latched all the way. Really? It doesn't go in gear. Any gear? Nope. Pump the pedal. Does it change it? I think the slave popped. Dang! Put the clutch disc on backwards. No, we didn't take it off. Yeah, they didn't take off this trans. It's a slave leak. They only took apart the KA trans. Push the clutch in. No, you got full extension. Well.